can I just take a second at the start of this intro to acknowledge the fact that for some reason, very early on this series, we died right here. In fact, day two, day two, we died right here. I built a brand spanking new base behind it and I never removed this gravestone. That's not the bizarre part. The bizarre part is I kind of just got used to it being there and I literally run and jump over it every single day without even thinking... Why is that still there? Why do I not demolish this gra- Anyways, yeah, I don't know. It just occurred to me just then. But guys, welcome back. Welcome back to our Mega Modern Survival. Uh, today, we are going to be looking into something that I wasn't really prepared for. Um, our, our prayers have been answered. The Ark Gods have been looking down on us, it appears. And uh, we may be able to make some crazy progress uh, that I didn't really think we were ready for. So, uh, yeah, it's going to be an interesting one if all goes according to plan. If you do enjoy the video, though, please go ahead and punch that thumbs up make it rain those thumbs ups now um look perhaps maybe this here is just a reminder of how much we suck at this game still <laughs> i wish i could go around and count all of the gravestones because actually no i can i can literally do that we've got a death counter going on we are beyond 60 deaths this series that's averaging more than one a day yeah Anyways, as you know, we have been saving up jerky using these things right here. Some of these might even be getting, yeah, I was going to say, running out of oil. And that's still just, and meat. No, it's still got meat just running out of oil. But the reason we're doing this is for kibble. And what we're using this kibble for is to tame up these guys over here. We've been collecting a bit of a farm of broodmothers, for example. We got a double alphas and we got two regular ones over here. But what we've recently been seeking to do is get apexes, which have been a little bit more of a challenge, uh, mostly because the kibble that we were just talking about we do have this guy over here though our apex dodo wyvern which if you've been with us for the you know the the if you've been the, the past week really i was gonna say if you've been tuning in for the entire series you know what i'm talking about we're saving up currently to um hopefully collect a whole stash of these guys right here in fact currently we've got six apex boss eggs and what we plan to do with these eventually when the time is right is tame up some stuff like Chaos Dodo Wyverns, Chaos Megapithecuses. Uh, we might even have some a Spirit Broodmother. There's some crazy stuff out there that we are going to be able to tame. The problem is it's rather expensive to get. We're going to need some certain kibbles that require five eggs each. So as you could probably tell, we didn't have enough eggs. We need a lot more eggs so we can get a lot more kibble and we can make that happen. That's where things get a little interesting. I was just checking through our thingamabobby over here. Having a look. We got any, you know, Apex Manticores. We got any Apex Dragons. We got any Apex... We've already done Manticores. Mega... We actually do. Oh, yeah. This is the one from yesterday. There's a level 50, uh, 41, 44 one out there. And then I went ahead and typed in Broodmother. And what did I find? But three. There's three of them out there. If I can tame two out of three of these, I'm probably going to avoid the level 290 because that's going to take a lot of kibble to tame up. But if I can get these two here, guys, today, we are going to be... I mean, in fact, I'm going to go straight into it right this second. We ain't going to waste any time. I need these things now. So, yeah, that's what we're going to be um, <laughs> doing. And if we can make it happen early on, these guys are just going to like... They're just going to drop eggs like no tomorrow. It's going to be absolutely crazy. And then we can literally tame up a chaos boss like who knows at like soon best case scenario like very soon um so yeah we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna do this thing we're gonna do this thing assuming i've got everything that we actually need to make this happen that is uh which i'm hoping we do why did that that says savaroot hold on a second i just realized it's been like a year since i went and visited my farm over here is everything okay everything's are we good like i haven't been i should probably oh i should empty my farm um, in fact, I never even expanded my farm, bro. All right, can I move the seed over here? Can you do this? I don't even know if this works. Does that, does that, does that work? Are you still seeded, fruitling? Apparently you can do this. I remember weeks ago, I read a comment about that, that basically you can plant as many crops as you like using a single seed. I don't know how these things work, but our farm's working just fine. Okay, that's, that's all I wanted to check up on there. I kind of gave myself a heart attack, but um, that's cool. That is fine and dandy little yandy. What I am going to do really, really quickly though is I'm going to go advanced transfer and I want to transfer into here and I want to go ahead and grab all of our vegetables. Um, citronels, I want to grab the rocker, uh, rocker, rocker carrots. Um, these guys right here. And last but not least, long grass. I always forget long grass. Long grass is the one I always forget. Um, and then I want to move all of that into my refrigerator. Um, I don't, don't know where it is. S plus refrigerator. There it is. Transfer. Oh, 
All structures. Transfer. Bam. There we go. All right. So we've got all of our veggies in here now. And the other ones are all going to be cooking up while we wait. The major question. Oh, man. This stuff's going to take so long to craft up. Well, that's cool. I'm going to let it craft because I will need to go and check up on what we're actually going to be taming today and how much kibble we need to tame it up. The question is... Well, it's not really much of a question. Where is my spirit? Um, Griffin. Here it is. All right. Let's go. Let's do this thing. In fact, I've got a teleporter that's pretty close to the destination. So let's just teleport straight out there and work out how much kibble we need to get to with these things. This is like a dream come true, you guys. <laughs> I'm like, when I when I noticed that we had multiple Apex Brood Brothers in our world, I just about had a heart attack. Um... Yeah, this is exciting. This is really good. We are like on the verge of being able to do something I've never done in Ark before, and that is tame spirit and chaos bosses. Anyways, where are these guys? I know one of them is rather close to us. 6139. I'm actually legit just going to write this down so I don't have to keep on checking. Um, 6139 and 6024. Unfortunately, I'm riding over the top of some baby shark pictures I drew for my daughter. <laughs> She sits on my lap while I'm editing sometimes and we oh it's dope. Oh look at all the brood mothers down here. And we um we um what I don't even know where I'm going. Ooh. Light griffin. Light griffin. Hello. Anyways, brood mother, brood mother. There's just okay, well, none of these are brood mothers that I want, so I guess I'll just leave them for the time being. But um she loves baby shark, and I was drawing her some baby shark pictures the other day, and well, now they've gone and been tarnished, so never mind. Uh now I need to head east. 61.37 is where we are currently shooting for. How am I butchering this so badly? It's over here. Wow, okay. It's a long way off from where I thought it was going to be. Okay, should be... Oh, it's Big Cannon Turtle! Tortuga, Master of the Sea. I haven't seen you in so long, bro. This guy's crazy. I kind of want to avoid him. He's got cannons. And he shoots them in all directions. And I don't really want to be messing around with that right this second. We've got other things to be worrying about. Uh, like a brood mother. That should be, should be right here. Have I, did I write the coordinates down properly, guys? It's meant to be at 61, 37. Brood, let's see, even after writing the coordinates down now, I still need to go and check that I'm in the right place. What am I doing here? 61, 40, it moved, right? <laughs> did it move? I'm like, you couldn't move that far in such a short period of time. Is that it there? That's it. Also, crazy fight music beneath me. Um, is that an origin or is that a... I don't know. There's a primal or an origin nearby. Now, I'm going to make sure I don't kill this guy here. It has 22... It needs five kibble. Okay, so all together, we're going to need about nine kibble then, I think. Um, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to do something probably quite regrettable. Where's my big attack? Uh, okay, there it is. I want to wipe... Oh, no. I just remembered that this doesn't actually wipe out forests. Um, that was really risky to be dropping right this close to my dude over here. But it's fine, I think. It looks okay. Uh, what are you fighting over here, bro? At least we don't have fight music down here. So that's okay. Uh, I'm thinking, though... Look, because the torpor on these guys is getting relatively high... This guy's going to take me 44. I don't have enough arrows to knock this out. So we're going to have to get some origin arrows for this guy. Um, but... We've achieved what I wanted to do. I wanted to find out exactly how much kibble we need. So that one, there's five. Now we're going to go and visit the other one, which is at 6024, which is pretty much directly west. Directly west. I feel like it's going to be another five or a four. Also, look at all the Braid Brothers. There's so many out here. <laughs> this world is falling apart. It's unstable. It's unsustainable. And that's what I'm worried about. That is what I'm worried about. If we get some explosions like that, which we're probably going to, it will very likely kill the broodmother we're trying to tame up. So we have to be kind of careful. So 6024 should be right beneath us. Is that it? That is it. We need four kibble. Okay, all together then. We need nine kibble. It's as simple as that. We've got the information we need. That's actually pretty good. That's actually really good. That's like best case scenario right there. Nine kibble is going to get us over the line. Um, man, we are in dangerous territory. That's the part that has me worried, though. Like, there's... We're basically in the hands of Ark. We're in the hands of the game and the, the random crazy dinosaurs that are spawned on top of us. If they all behave themselves, we should be fine. So what do we need? Let's have a look. Uh, Apex boss kibble, this one right here. Only need nine of them. We're missing generic artifacts and boss essence. 
I forgot about boss essence, I suppose. All right, well, we can craft up three. That gets, that's, that's, that's pretty close. Uh, and now we just need to cross our fingers and hope that we've got some artifactos the great in the wild, which we have four of. Okay, then. That's pretty good. All right, we're going to go and kill these guys then. Uh, that's good. That's good. That's fantastic. That is really, really great news. That is like incredible news as a matter of fact. <laughs> Otherwise, we were going to have to hit up so many caves. Uh, but what I am going to do... And head back to the teleporter that we just teleported to. Remember all those brood brothers that we just stumbled across? I'm going to go and kill them all now. Because I need their boss essence to make these kibbles. So, why not? Also, there's one right here. Um, I don't think these things are even that strong. There we go. That's a sneaky old 24 boss essence. Now, where did those other three... There are so many. There's just... There's stuff everywhere. So, it's a, a lot of the stuff that is currently in this area is things that we spent a lot of time looking for early on in this series and now it's just everywhere and i'm still adapting to it imagine every day for like a month and a half you just can't find the things you're looking for like a light griffin <laughs> i think that's the first one of those i found all series um and now they're like all over this place it's just it's baffling me basically anyways good amount of boss essence just like that love to see it time to find some artifactos also, Alpha Broodmother right here. May as well go and get some extra boss essence as we head on up north. Um, I am kind of worried about these Apex Broodmothers, though. I'm not going to lie. It has me... Like, the... Like, the... the, 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 the like, the... Uh, the, the, the I don't know. <gasps> wait. Oh, that's an Alpha. That's not the Apex. Oh, I, I, I was like, wait a second. That one only needs two kibble. Um, it wasn't the one that we need to tame up. That's why. Uh, but these two here, I'm going to kill them both. Or at least I'm going to try to. I don't even know what's going on right now. All right, that's one down. And the second one. I'm so close to hitting the water. And if I do, I'm going to die. Are we good? Oh, that one's still alive. Now you're dead. Okay, cool. Thanks, guys. Appreciate you. All right, let's get out of here before we do anything dumb. Okay. Fancy that, eh? <laughs> um, I think Artifacto's around here somewhere. But he might end up just burning to the... What was that? There's some crazy explosions beneath us. I'm just going to go and blast the place and just see what kind of comes of it. Um, in fact, no, that's probably a bad idea. I I don't actually know what Artifacto is. Yeah, okay, I'm going to be careful here. Uh, if I don't actually kill Artifacto properly, I'm and, you know, if he dies, basically, I don't, I don't see where his body was, then uh, I'm not going to be able to loot him. And we're going to miss out on our wonderful essence. But he should be pretty much here. Literally at like 37.50. I think I just saw his hat. There he is. There he is. All right, I see you there, bro. Um, yeah, we're going to try and avoid him though. I don't want to make contact with him. I'm pretty sure he can dismount us from our team. So we got to be careful. And basically, just got to get nice and close to him. And hit him with a few of these lightning blasts. And then we're just going to make sure that we melee him to finish him off. Good. Looking good. Nearly there. Please don't hurt me. Surprise is not trying. And again, what's he going to do, right? So, all right, now we're going to melee. One more hit. Bam. There we go. How many artifacts? Four artifacts from that one there. Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Now we're pretty much doubling back to the center of the map. So let's go and get another two. In fact, I was going to say maybe I'll just... I'll just fly. All right, we have visuals of the next one. Now, what's cool about this is there should actually be two of them out here. And I don't know if they're like on the exact same spot. They're, bit, they're really, really close. Also, this one here is much... This is really weak. All right, I'm going to melee this one from the start because why not? There we go. And one more hit. Uh, that's it. Three. Okay. Okay, that was a bit of an unfortunate one. We only got three out of that, but that's fine. Um, like I said, though, there should be one right next to us as well. 5149, which is a little bit this way. And a little bit this way. Ish. Should be like right here. Ish. We're going to go north. There he is. Told you we wouldn't be far. This one got a little bit more health. Well, a lot more health than the last one did, though. But we've already got enough. Uh, actually, yeah, I'm not even going to bother with the fourth one. We've got enough artifacts to do what we got to do today. So we're good. Oh, okay. That's unfortunate. I, I really ruined that. This is what I was talking about, though. When you do this wrong. So what is with the music? 
There's either an origin or a prime. I think there's an origin nearby. Oh, uh, that's going to be hard work. All right, it's going to go for it. It's going to go for it. We're going to ignore the fact that there's something nearby that could probably kill us. It's all good. We got all four artifacts. And we are out of here. Let's go. Okay. We're getting double brood brothers today, baby. Double brood brothers today. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. Let's do this. Okay. And let's just, at least, let's just hope that we've got everything that we actually need to make this happen. Because it'll be disappointing if we don't. So, uh, I've got my 106 boss essence right here. Apex boss kibble. I need nine of those. Seven. What am I missing? One artifact. Wait, and how much boss essence? And Apex Kibble. Wait, what? Oh, because I already had some crafted up. We're good. It's okay. It's okay. Never mind. I forgot we'd already crafted a whole batch of this stuff. We've got enough. We've got everything that we need. I just got to make sure we don't overcraft now. Because uh, hopefully we'll never have to get another Apex ever again. So that is six. That is seven. Two more. And uh, yeah, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Let's get rid of all these broodmother heads. They're, they're hurting me back. And that's that. This is the last one. Oh, so good. So good. So good. Nine kibble. Oh, that's right. We still have two more things we got to craft up. We are going to need some origin narcotics. Two of these bad boys, which we should be able to get pretty easily. And last but not least, two of these arrows, which are going to insta knock out whatever we shoot with them. And it's time. It's time to go get both of these apexes. Why do I get the feeling something's not going to go according to plan? It's got that feeling. It's got that feeling. When things go too smoothly and too swimmingly, there's always something that's going to come in the way and just interrupt everything and just, just you know, make sure things don't go smooth enough. And I just feel like, I feel like, ah, uh, I feel like today's just gone too prob like unproblematic. To uh, uh, I got a bad feeling. I got a bad feeling, guys. I got a bad feeling. But hey, until something bad happens, let's not think about it. Where is the apex? That's a that's a big boy. That's the primal. Didn't even know there was a primal out here. Um, is that the apex there? Yeah, that looks like an apex. Well, at least he's kind of wandering out of the swamp. Um, I'm going to kill this thing. I want its boss essence. And I know I can kill it. And it's, you know, it's strong. <laughs> so I kind of just want to get rid of this. And I can't tame it. So we may as well. Dude, I just one shot it. Oh my gosh. Like, I knew I was going to kill it easy. I did not expect the one shot. That is awesome, though. We just did 100 and what? How much? 130 million damage with a single attack. That is crazy. And it's all uphill from here still. I feel like we can get stronger. That's the, Otherwise, we wouldn't be doing this. Anyways, let's go and equip these special arrows. I, if I miss this, I'll cry. But we should be okay. Also, something's been fighting my friend. Also, 60 million torpor on this one here. I probably could have just knocked it out on my own. Um, but that's cool. All right. I want to lure it somewhere that's somewhat friendly. So like over here would be nice. And then you can just go to sleep. Go to sleep. Don't want you to anger anything. Don't anger anything. Don't anger anything. Okay. That's cool. You, you're just going to one shot everything anyway. So it doesn't matter. Kill the Bronto. That'll be your last kill. And then you go on to sleep, please. Yes. Come and get me. Come and get me. Yes. Right here. Right here. This is a great spot. Great location prime real estate and he's asleep great okay nice all right now we are gonna have a little bit of a little bit of problems with these little guys but that's fine how many kibble do you need four kibble i'm just gonna go for it i'm not wasting no time let's go one two three and four and just like that we've got our apex brood mother um, now I just got to light up these little dudes because they're being a pain in the backside by just existing really. And that's that. Okay. Now it's not often I use this method, but I'm going to do it. I'm going to use a little soul trap. I'm going to pick you up and put you in there. Okay. Ah! <laughs> I forgot about the other one. <laughs> oh, you surprised me, buddy. Uh, unfortunately for you, you probably would have been better off not doing that because, well, now you're going to meet your own, uh, unfortunate death there you go all right your demise let's go and get the other one now which is just over here and i'm hoping this one's moved into a safer location as well because where it was last time i wasn't a big fan of but you know we, we work with it we'll see what we can do and we'll go from there now 
I think it was over here. I might need to recheck the coordinates. But I think... Is that it? That's an alpha, isn't it? So many. That's the apex. Okay, cool. That's the one. All right. Now, what are we dealing with out here, eh? It's looking somewhat friendly. I'm hoping I can just hit it with an arrow. And then we can move on. All right. So, there we go. Need to wait for that 22 million torpor to set in. What I am a little concerned about is it's going to anger something in the area that... Because they, they just go on a rampage when you hit them with one of these arrows. Um, yeah, I don't, I'm not... Okay, maybe I just... <gasps> you. I got to get rid of this. Primal tech. You have ruined my day in the past, old primal techs. And I'm not letting today be one of those days. We are not repeating what's happened in the past. Okay, there we go. Nice. Also, look at these guys. They're all kind of like lit up. They're like little light bulbs. Little fireflies. Fire spiders. Anyways, that's it. It's asleep. Things look pretty friendly. Just going to go ahead and drop all five of those bad boys in there. And I think... <laughs> I think that's it. 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 I'm pretty sure that's it. We got ourselves a pair of Apex Brew Mothers. What a terrible beat that is. Because that really doesn't rhyme or anything like that. And there's explosions. And I should get myself out of here as quick as possible. Let's go. All right. <laughs> we did it. We did it. We did it. We did it. Actually, I forgot to check. Oh, they're both males as well. How can they be brood mothers? They're brood fathers. We've tamed up two brood fathers. Well, I need a brood father and a brood mother. So we're going to change that up right this second. Um, you might. Mm, okay. Okay. You're in the way, but it's okay. All right. All right. You drop down here, buddy. Um, I'm going to drop five of this in here. Create the pulse. I wonder if this gives a gender to Nova the Destroyer. I don't think it will. I don't think it does. Because you're a new gender. Okay, that's cool. Well, now we've got ourselves what we wanted. A male and a female. Let's go introduce them to the rest of our little broodmother pack. That is forever growing. But I think that's it. I don't know. I don't think I'm ever going to get another broodmother. <laughs> Unless there's like some crazy spirit or chaos broodmother that like I just didn't anticipate taming up. Um, we've already got too many though. But there's one. Oh my gosh, man. There's no room. And there we go. Okay, double brood brothers. I think they're mate boosted. They should be mate boosted. I'm pretty sure they're mate boosted. Um, fantastic. Cool. All right. Well, get laying some eggs for me, you two. I need lots of them. I need a plentiful amounts of them. Yeah, I need I need actual like tons of them actually. So cool. That's awesome. That's fantastic. And now the only way forward here, or like literally all that's left to do is jump in here. And if I want some Chaos Boss Kibble, we craft up the Chaos. I can actually get one right this second. I can almost get two. But man, we've run out of Boss Essence. And this is where I start questioning... Oh, I got 446 on me. But this is where I start questioning why I went and wasted a whole batch on a saddle. Well, my Dodo Wyvern, because yeah, it's completely gone to waste now. <laughs> Anyways, what exactly... Like, what... I, I want to go on. I want to go and pay a visit to, I guess... I kind of want to see what a Chaos Dodo Wyvern looks like. But also, there's another Chaos Megapithecus out there at 2530. And you're at 2760. All right. I got to go and pay these two a visit because this is what it's all for. This is what it's all coming down to. I need to know how many kibble we need. Um, at least to get the high level, which is the uh, Megapithecus. And then I'll go and check out the Dodo Wyvern. And then I guess it's up to me on who we end up wanting to actually pursue. Uh, but I feel like it's going to be like eight kibble. I think we're going to need like eight of these, which is going to be really expensive. But I need to know what I need, right? That's, that's what I'm talking about. Well, I just flew up from the obelisk and I can hear... There it is. <laughs> I was going to say, I can hear that molten sound. There he is. 19 million health. I have never seen a wild dinosaur that strong. A tameable wild dinosaur. I should probably put an asterisk there. It only needs seven kibble though. Okay. Like it's... You know, that's a lot of kibble. So you got three and a half thousand torpor. Uh, sorry, three and a half million torpor as well. But that's what we got to basically shoot for. So seven kibble. If we plan on going for this one. 
However, if we plan on going for the... And this is just for the time being. We don't know what's going to spawn in between now and when we're actually ready to do this. That's the other thing. Not to mention, if I really want to collect some fast boss essence, I should probably kill one of these two chaos guys. And then, like... Well, I don't know. I don't know. Is that... Hold on. Whatever we're hearing right this second is the chaos Dodo Ivan. I just got to follow the sounds. Are they down here? There is a Dodo Wyvern in here. I just saw it. You're not what I'm looking for though, mate. Out of here. All right. Someone is making a big old ruckus and I got to find it. Dodo Wyvern, Dodo Wyverns. Where is the big old chaos fella? Another Dodo Wyvern, but not the chaos variety. May as well get rid of it and get a bit of boss essence from you. There he is. There he is. There he is. Oh, look at him. He's kind of stuck too. Oh, and he needs five kibble. Oh boy. I think he's stuck. He's guarding an egg. Oh, hello. Um. Oh gosh, I can't see a thing. I just, <laughs> okay, we're okay. We're okay. I had a little mini heart attack there for a second. Uh, yeah. This guy's stuck. Oh, you're in the... You're the, the, the oh, are you? Oh, no, you're not stuck. Okay, false alarm, false alarm. All right, I actually have to be careful here that I don't get hit by his poison blast because it will... Actually, that's... if It is like a... Reg oh, gosh, he's quick. Oh, gosh, he's actually fast. Okay. Um. Well, that, that, that's that's what I'm talking about anyways, okay? 7.6 million torpor. Sorry, health. About 4 million torpor. I could... Man, you guys are easier to knock out than the Apex bosses I just took down. But, yeah, we got a few steps ahead of us before we're able to do that. Uh, we got to get the kibble. Like I said, four more kibble to get this one. And then a whole bunch to get the other one. But for now, let's get out of here. Oh, is this thing just... Hold on. Is this thing going to keep on following me? Hold on. Wait, where did it go? All right. No, no, no. Okay, we're okay. I thought maybe it just doesn't unload and it's stuck like in your range. I got a little mini. Got a little, got a little scared there for a second. But it's okay. Now, there is one last thing right here that I want to pay a visit to. That guy right there. Spirit brood mother. I just got a quick a drop a quick bomb on it. Also, this one only needs two kibble. I could literally like tame you up right now with just a tiny little bit more effort, but too late, you're dead. Uh, anyways, I just wanted the boss essence from it. <laughs> we, like I said, we're running low on this stuff, so we need to like resupply. I actually could have tamed up that brood mother like right now. That might have been a mistake. Maybe I shouldn't have just done what I just did, but oh well, it's too late. We can't turn back time. We gotta live with our mistakes. I mean, I wouldn't say that was a mistake as such, but anyways, you get the idea. Um, fantastic. you love to see it. All right, let me go and drop this stuff off. So yeah, it's literally just a waiting game now waiting between us and getting us a chaos boss. Um, speaking of which, we have three eggs. Are they even laying me eggs? I actually don't know. We're not getting many. If they're laying me eggs, they're being pretty slow about it. I'll tell you what. Um, but three eggs. I had those already, didn't I? <laughs> Broodmothers. Can you guys work a little bit harder, please? Can you guys generate me some eggs a little bit quicker? Eddie, what are you doing out here, mate? What in the world are you doing out here? All right. Well, look, maybe if I just turn away and don't look at them, maybe maybe, maybe I'll give them a little bit of space. Maybe they'll lay me some more eggs. Maybe if I just chill at base, they'll lay me some more eggs. Um, but yeah, we are on the we are on the verge of doing it. Now, while we do wait for that to happen, because it may take a few days, we're going to turn our attention back to old pick on the creator. We are getting pretty close to taking this guy here. We just got a bit of a boss run to go through before we're like 100% ready. But again, just around the corner. So that's going to be exciting to... We can finally go and match the destroyer with the creator and uh, even things up just a touch. But guys, if you did enjoy the video, please go ahead and punch that thumbs up. Make it rain those thumbs ups. And until next time, keep on smiling. Have a fantastic day and I'll catch you tomorrow. Bye for now.